Well, what's going on, YouTubers? My name is Robert Sorrento Jr., and I am the natural born thriller. And welcome, everyone, to WWE 205 Live Review, the show from August 28th, 2018. And they're in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Your commentators were Rick Joseph, Nigel McGuinness, and Percy Watson. So let's not waste any time. Let's get right into it. Akira Tozawa defeats D. Brian Kendrick. D. Brian Kendrick was being accompanied by the gentleman Jack Gallagher. And there was no Drew Gulak. But um, this match itself between Akira Tozawa and D. Brian Kendrick, it was pretty decent. And Akira Tozawa wins the match. Nothing else to say about that match. So there you go. And probably folks, I'm just gonna just just uh rapid fire this up uh, yo this uh, review. So uh we get Hideo Otami uh versus uh I'm trying to remember his name. Yeah, I can't remember his name. I think his name was Michael Bernard or something like that. I don't know, I don't remember, but Hideo Tommy by the way looks looks in incredible shape by the way. He looks like he's back in good in good shape now. Um but yeah, Hideo Tommy, he's um he's back being confident again. He's back being um um uh, uh, in his group again, and he's back in good shape again. And basically, he um had the match. He had match one about uh, about two to three times, in, in the match. And all of a sudden, we get the music play of Mustafa Ali. So yeah, Mustafa Ali makes his return after being taken out by Hideo Tommy uh for what about uh, a month ago. So he dare Tommy's uh is trying to yo Masala Lee get in there and Masala Lee's rolling his uh his sleeves up. Okay, he runs down there and he tells and, and the WWE had the he dare Tommy walk out. I'm like really? Like are you kidding me? You, this is how you go book he dare Tommy to be a, a chicken shit heel like. Oh my god, that this is not he dare Tommy. Yo, AKA Kenta. This is not who he is. He doesn't run he, he doesn't run away from fights. I don't care if he is a heel. He doesn't run away run away from fights. That was, I thought that was bullshit, but whatever. Uh, Cedric Alexander, the WWE Cruiserweight Champion, cut a promo about, you know, to um, about Drew Gulak. Uh, I didn't care much about it, really. Um, I'm, just, I'm just trying to get away from that stigma of that that, that horrible segment promo that Cedric, that Cedric and 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 Gulak had from 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 the last episode of of you know. To a lot from Brooklyn, New York, the same, uh, the same one that I went to, to, to see the show, and then I was I was bored from that show and all that, and and after doing a lot of reaction on my tablet and everything, yes, I still felt I still felt the same way. So yeah, um, I didn't like it, so and I didn't care for it either. So there you go. Um, uh, main event, we got Buddy Murphy. Oh yeah, I should mention uh. There was no uh, Dasha Flindes interviewing, um, in, you know, before the match started, but you had um, Kayla Braxton instead interviewing Buddy Murphy, who was there with uh, Tony Nese about you know Buddy Murphy's gonna have a match, match against Kalisto, and they showed replays of about about the event that took place from uh, from from Brooklyn, New York, between um, Buddy Murphy and Tony Nese f f facing a Lucha House Party, where Kalisto got involved, where it led to um, that that factor into the match where. Uh, Lucha House Party One, and this is what led to the match between um, Buddy Murphy versus uh, Kalisto. So they having a match, right? And you had Tony Nese at ringside for Buddy Murphy, and you had the Lucha House Party and uh, Lisa Dorado and Grand Metalik there uh, for Kalisto. And so they having this match, you know, right? And already, uh, you, you know, Tony Nese gets in the ring, and then we get the, the rest of the Lucha House Party in the ring, and the referee is trying to calm things down and all that. You know, the uh, the, the, the the main team order. Finally, he got maintained. He maintained the order, and also there's more outside interferences and all that. Buddy Murphy pushes pushes um Mrs. Dorado to Grand Metal League. Mrs. Dorado tries to go after uh, Buddy Murphy, but the referee tells uh no, you can't do that. And he's like, you know what? You and you, you're out of here. And then uh Tony Nese was uh was uh, mocking them, and then those those were pinata at them, and then there you go. And the match continues on, and then also in Tony Nese trips Kalisto while the referee was was looking, and then um. And then you know, Blake Murphy takes takes advantage of that. And then Tony Nese was uh was uh being talk, was uh, was being, was, talk, was being talked to by the by the referee. And the referee uh you you already know what's coming from that one. He escorts him out too. So this became, just just became um between Blake Murphy and Kalisto. And after that, 
the match uh, ends up being, you know, it, it, it picking up being um, decent. It ends up being picking up um, a little more decent. And then it ends up uh, picking up to being a very, very good match. A lot of very cool, cool spots in the match. And then in the end, Bay Murphy gets to win with the, the Murphy's Law. And, and there you go. He gets to, uh, the win. And Tony, Tony comes out to help, you know, to, um, help him celebrate, celebrate his victory, I guess. And that, and that was it. That's how the show ends with uh, Bay Murphy uh, getting, getting back on track of, 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 of being a winner on 205 Live. So Tom my wrestling for the most exciting hour for 205 Live. Three matches. It couldn't win that didn't um that, that that basically ended in a no contest. But yeah, three matches. And my overall strength for the show for 205 Live. The show from August. What day was it again? Uh, now, nah. okay, August 28, 2018. Or should I say August 28th, 2018. I'll give the show a, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. I thought it was, I thought it was a, a decent show. Passable. So, there you go. If this is your first time watching me, my name is Robert Serrano Jr. And I am the Natural Born Thriller. If you haven't subscribed to me yet, please do so right now. And, like I said before, usually I'll, um, uh, you know, I'll, you know, I'll, I'll take a shot, but I'll have my shot glass with me, but take a drink with the Natural Born Driller. So, if you enjoyed this review, feel free to give it a thumbs up, or give it a thumbs down. Either way, the choice is yours, and yours alone. And you all take care, and I'll talk to you all soon, but for now, peace. On the streets, I'm out.